Greetings all. It is I, thine internet Uncle Yatsu, here on the fourth age, chopping down a whole bunch of trees, collecting a whole bunch of sticks. Uh, literally, I have spent the entire night deforesting areas <laughs> of this uh, acacia forest, but it has been worth it. I have, in fact, I have on my back in yonder box, I have another two full stacks of acacia wood. So I have plenty of wood. Uh, I figured we could use it if, you know, a miracle occurs and we manage to locate some um, copper. We will have plenty to make charcoal with. I didn't quite get as many sticks as I'd hoped to get. But I did, I was able to make some more ladders. So hopefully 15 uh, should set us. I don't think we really have too much further to go over there. But of course it was way too dark to find out last night. Um, I did manage to gather some vines. And I know I've got a few more back upstairs in the boxes. Um, I guess I want to go this way. Um, I know I've got a few more vines upstairs, so we should be able to hopefully get something together <laughs> and get across to the other side of this thing and see where we want to put our monkey bridge today. That is, in fact, today's goal. <laughs> that looks cool. Get my arms out of the way. <laughs> it's just like monkey bridges spanning every part of this mountain. That's going to be awesome. I'm so ready for it. Uh, I also managed to take out a rabbit. So I had, and some chickens, so I had like actual meat-filled dinner. You guys, it was great. I was so happy. Um, <laughs> here, we'll put you, um, can I put you back? Thank you. Okay. Let us, yeah, we have now four stacks and a bit of acacia wood. Almost five full stacks. Yeah, that's amazing. I'm into it. Uh, we're going to put that as well. This is what we're taking with us. Yeah, let me just disgorge myself of some of these things and then we can get going. <laughs> okay, beautiful. Extra items have been disgorged. <laughs> I'm going to take this with me just for safety. I don't know what is safe about it, but we're going to take it with us anyway. We have... Yeah, let's put the ladders... Let's organize this so when I fall off of this thing, I know which button to press <laughs> to hopefully slam some ladders onto the side of this mountain and prevent myself from absolutely hitting the entire ground. Okay. I love monkey bridges. Absolutely love them. That's a great time. That is a great time. <laughs> also, I forgot I left my... There we go. Left my stuff in there. It's going to be hard to get a monkey bridge together if all of our supplies are in the bag. Okay, let's... Yeah, I think I'm going to want it basically here. So this is... Let me write this stuff down, because otherwise I'll get to the other side of this and I'll be so focused on having survived it that I won't remember what the heck is going on. 5207, 181, 59, 42. Okay. And I think we're just going to leave that open so I know where I am. The last thing I bloody need is to get all the way across here and then just put the thing in the wrong damn place. All right. Let us carefully descend and scoot across. Okay, that actually, that was one of the safest passages I think I've ever had. Wow. Either I'm getting better at this or... <laughs> that seems unlikely, doesn't it? Okay. Oh yeah, by the way, um, there is like some sort of giant hole in the ground, like right there. So, um, let's be extra careful, okay? 
<laughs> okay, so we're trying to get over here, basically. Man, look at these trees. Wow, these are cool. All right, please do not. Look at all the vines on those boys. Wow. Yeah, this is the little, the thin space that I thought was a little bigger that we looked at from up here. Oh, I can't wait to see it. I'm excited. All right, let's get down here without absolutely dying. And then it looks like we can maybe come back up here relatively safely. Let's not jinx ourselves, but it seems that we will not be dying immediately today. I cannot help myself. I cannot help myself. Oh yeah, I fell down here last night. Yeah, that's where the waterfall is. There was a rock slide and I almost died, but, uh... Okay, we're just gonna ignore that. That... <laughs> just... Any rock slide-like noises that I hear, I'm just going to ignore. That's today's plan. Unless the actual ground directly under me starts to fall, I'm not there for it. I'm just not there for it. Five giant redwood trees on the tallest mountain known to Seraph kind. That's cool. I'm into that. Oh, okay. All right. That's fine. That's why this is all rock up here. Uh, looks like it used to be dirt, though, as we can see from the fact that the trees are now hanging in nothingness. Okay, here we are. That is cool. Yeah, we are 100% building a bridge over to that island just to be able to say that we did it. That is cool. <laughs> that is so cool. All right, we're going to crouch. We're going to crouch a lot. We need to be over here, I think. We're going to continue to crouch. Oh, there. Solid rock, my beloved. Okay. Oh, are we in the right... It's right here. It's literally right here. Okay. Uh, I'm not against that. I'm not against that at all. Okay. Hello. Uh, yeah. I guess that means... Yeah, I guess that means those go there, huh? I, I don't... Uh, yeah, you need more monkey bridge. It looks like you need more pieces of monkey bridge. God, bloody... <laughs> <laughs> Crap. Okay. All right. Um, Crap. I'm irritated. It's going to be a lot too, isn't it? 5207. Yeah, we need like 50 pieces of monkey bridge. Okay. Um, it's one of these to every two of these, I think, isn't it? Yeah. Unfortunately, one of those is... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Um, actually, I can make it with this, though. That on it? That's still not nearly enough? Yeah, okay. All right, well then. Um, it looks like we have... I mean, honestly, it looks like we have a lot of vines up here, though, don't we? Let's... Yeah, let's... Oh, oh, hi, sir. Hello. <laughs> he looks at me like, hello. <laughs> Don't worry, bro. I'm just here for your vines. Okay. If we just leave each other alone, I know there's not so much space on here as there could be, but if we just leave each other alone, this will go very well for both of us. Okay. Yeah. Let me come up here and get these, get these vines. And I, I am going to continue to leave, um, like the initial piece of the vine just in case they do regrow. I kind of think that they don't, but... Oh, oh, jeez, sir. Okay. There's no reason to harass me. Oh, jeez, bro! Oh, Lord, if I get killed on the top of a mountain by some super irate sheep, I'm going to be mad. <laughs> bro, you are still mad at me. Well, guess what? I need dinner. That's right. 
Listen, sorry, dude. I gave you the opportunity of leaving me alone, and you chose not to, so... Now you are dinner. Thank you for your contribution. <laughs> Apologies to any kith and kin who may already be aware of your personality traits. Okay, let's see. Forty. This will be forty eight, I believe. Forty four, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, nature will provide. As a matter of fact, we're just going to basically get all that we can carry. Because one glance at this landscape will tell you that we are going to need a wide variety of monkey bridges. That's 48. Uh, here, let's come up here and get these guys. Just looking for some low-hanging fruit or low-hanging vines, I guess, as the case may be here. <laughs> thank you, thank you, and thank you. Okay, one of these... And two of these. 52. Okay, we should be able to make it across. Boom, baby. <laughs> oh, man. It's still scary, isn't it? Knowing full well that I've walked across three and four of these things to get here. Oh, beautiful. Okay. Let's come around here one last time. Very, very carefully. Jesus Christ. I'm getting a little cocky. I can feel it. <laughs> there. Retrieve our ladders. Oh. <laughs> okay, there we go. Well, wow, that's kind of a half full complement of ladders. And we have two more monkey bridges. It's this part that's creepy. Walking right <laughs> walking right underneath the thing. That's uh, right underneath the mountain. That's the part that's a little bit creepy, actually. Okay, okay. Welcome to our new home. Um, <laughs> such as it is. Yeah, this is it, I guess. This is where we've... Oh, look, there's a clay deposit over there. Do you see it? Beautiful. This this is where we've chosen to live. So there's a clay deposit. We already know it's a great place. <laughs> okay, let's go over and take a peek at it and see what nature has in store for us. Not that it's been really calming so far, but <laughs> I love all the little skeletons we're finding along the way, too. Like, that just makes me feel so safe. It looks like an egg down there. It looks like someone has left a glowy egg down there. Oh, well, we do have some of these firewood trees. We've got a collection of vines in a trench coat over there. <laughs> um... Oh, actual pigs. Oh, and a sheep of some kind. Oops, sorry. Yep, sorry. 
Yet another deceased animal. Oh, chickens. Hi, chickens. Listen, babies. I'm gonna have to actually catch you. We're gonna have to learn how the reed trap works. Look, a whole... Um... Are, are these your parents? Just a baby and a bunch of skeletons? Why is that one... Is he dead? Okay, there's nothing gruesome up here, is there? Oh, wow, look at that view. Holy cow, that's cool. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's where it's at. Some little steps right there, just, you know, for my staring pleasure, I guess. Looks like we have another deceased animal over there. Is there a serial killer on this island? <laughs> Look, that one's dead. Is that... What is going on? I think that one's dead, too. I am going to show up here very carefully. Very, very carefully. It could be that it's just rock slides that kill these guys. I mean, obviously, we saw plenty of them on the side of the mountain on the way up. So it's... It's eaten by another creature. Okay. Okay. We may have problems, boys. Oh, that's Flint. Okay. Um, we are going to very carefully scout around. Is that one dead, too? I can't tell. Partially eaten by another creature, large bite marks. Oh, I hate to even voice this opinion, but I think that means it was a bear. Hi, guys. Look, he's dead too, poor guy. Jeez. There was an absolute massacre here. What happened, boys? Um, I think that one's dead as well. Okay, didn't know I was gonna uncover a crime scene when I got up here. Jeez. Uh, well, I mean, I guess the... Yeah, large bite marks. I guess I can only hope it's on the other side of that ridge and will not see me or be aware of my presence in any way. On the other hand, this is quite a bounty for me. I didn't have to fight these guys at all. And I get plenty of meat and fat and pelts. This is... I'm so sorry, little kid. This is kind of a good thing for me, but it does make me a little creeped out. <laughs> Okay, well, I guess before the sun sets, I sure would like to come up over this ridge and see if I should be worried about a bear. Hi, sir. Is there a large serial killer on the loose? Up oh, hi, guys. Hi. Are you trying to warn me about something or are you trying to bless my presence? Excuse me, guys. Ah, there's the clay deposit we saw. Good deal. Always like to have clay deposits right where I am. Oh, looks like we have a cave as well that might actually exit out the side of the mountain. That could be nice. Give ourselves a back exit just in case we really need to leave at a moment's notice. <laughs> Is that a chicken? It's hard to tell at this distance. Uh, blue clay. All right, that's fine. I'll take some of that. Okay. Well, 
I guess I'm wondering if some of the very large skeletons we found uh, were bears that got caught in a caught in a landslide or something. I guess that's all I can really think is that it must have been a bear that ate those guys. I think that's what it means when it says, you know, large bite marks. I don't see any... Let me not jinx myself, but I don't see any bears around here or indeed any evidence of bears. So I guess I'm just going to hope that some of those very large skeletons we saw um, on the way over... Oh, carefully. Were bear skeletons. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, there he is! There he is! Okay. So there is a bear around here. Yeah. Well, we're going to have to take care of him. Yeah, we're going to have to take care of him at some point, but it's getting dark out here, and I'm not interested in fighting a bear in the middle of the night. So I think we're just going to go back to our little hovel for this evening. Man, that bear must be well fed. He's killed like four dudes. Wow. I mean, good for him. <laughs> the fact that there's stairs already right here kind of makes me want to settle right here, you know? It's not the largest place on Earth. I guess what we're probably going to do is have, like, everything, you know, each place that we need, like a bedroom, a kitchen, a wherever. I think they're all going to be individual rooms, you know, <laughs> like individual... um what did I? It's over there. Individual um, places on the, you know, on individual towers, maybe. Because there's just not a lot of totally flat ground around here. Ah, mm hmm, mm hmm. Called that one. Yep. Okay. Well, that's why you come prepared. Can I? Thank you. All right. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna get myself home. Thank, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Am I even headed in the right direction? Yes, I am. I'm just coming at it from the wrong direction. <laughs> Let's refrain from dying. We'll come around the other way. Ah! Okay, what did I just say about not dying? What did I just say? <laughs> hey, there's another creeper face. Okay. I think this world is trying to tell me that I should be very, very careful. <laughs> All right, well, you can tell from the way that I keep... Um, pulling the map open that I am not able to find my bridge home right now. So I guess I'm just going to hang out on the top of this here mountain and hope that I don't get attacked by a bear in the middle of the night. Um, <laughs> we're going to have to get some copper so we can get some um, so we can get some lanterns so we can actually like put down roots and figure out Uh, so we can actually, you know, put down some some pathways and some roads so that I stop getting so lost all the time. But anyway, in the meantime, <laughs> the sun is setting and I'm just going to hunker down and try not to get myself mauled by anything that is twice my size and pretty angry about it. Um, thanks for joining me, everybody. Uh, tomorrow we shall attempt to actually figure out where we want to live. Have a nice day. Bye.